The Apple News app has always been a great source for the latest and greatest news stories. And now Apple just made the experience even better for a monthly fee, of course. This is Retethered, and this is our review of the Apple News Plus subscription and what you can expect from it. If you haven't already, please subscribe for the latest tech news and reviews. Let's get started. When you go into the Apple News app, you may have a hard time finding where the Apple News Plus tab is actually at. That's because Apple News Plus is only available on iOS 12.2, so you're going to have to update in order to start using the new service. Once the new software update is downloaded and ready to go, Apple lets you sign up for the new service. And they're even giving you a 30 day free trial, at least for now they are. After that, the service is $9.99 per month. The app is clean and very easy to get around, very similar to the regular Apple News app, which remains the same and free by the way. To get to the plus area, you click on the News Plus tab, which is on the left on the iPad and on the bottom on the iPhone. Apple says that there are over 300 magazines available at launch, with more to come. And on first glance, it looks about right. There is everything from sports magazines to home and cooking to tech. Whatever your interest is, there is definitely a magazine for you. On the main menu up top, you can select the genre you want to read and even browse through the selection alphabetically. Below that you have the recent magazines that you've read or saved and you can even download the magazines for offline reading as well. As you scroll down, you see some recommendations on some articles that you might be interested in. And there's even an area where you can see what new issues are available. When you open up a magazine, it immediately takes you to a table of content style page where you can select which article you want to read. And it's very easy and straightforward. Apple has done a great job making the whole application easy to use and find exactly what you're looking for. The bottom line, for $9.99, you're getting loads of great content. If you're paying a monthly subscription now for any of these magazines, then it's definitely worth canceling that subscription and going with Apple News Plus. Unless you actually like having the physical copy in your hands. What do you think of the Apple News Plus service? Are you planning on signing up and giving it a try? Let me know with a comment down below. If you liked the video, please give it a thumbs up. And if you really liked the video, subscribe for more tech news and reviews. Thanks for watching.